Hey folks, Matt from right of the image.com. I've got a question in here on the email. This is from Dilshan. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, it's, he says, uh, Hi Matt, I've been one of your regular viewers for a long time now. Last year I bought an Nikon D7200 by your recommendation with the 18-140 to kit lens. And for portraits, a Nikon 50mm F1.8G. I love both these lenses, so thanks for that awesome recommendation. Now I need to expand my lens collection and need to buy a new lens. I looked at my Lightroom catalog and most of the shots are taken in a long focal length, 80 to 140. So my question is, what lens would you recommend to me? I'm torn between a Tamron 70-200 f2.8 and a Nikon 85mm f1.8. Can you suggest me a good lens, any of these two, or something else? If you get any time, please reply. By the way, your videos are very informative and they help lots of people, so keep up the good work. Thank you very much. Well, thank you, Dilshan. Appreciate that, and thank you for your question. Between these, um, that's very insightful and thoughtful that you went through your light, Lightroom catalog and you looked to see what you were shooting in what range. Um, so the lenses you've picked fall within that range. Um, my question, though, would be, did you look in the catalog to see what apertures you were shooting at? Because um, if you're shooting in that focal length, but you're more portraits or low light, then the 85, I think, would be the way to go. If you're not, if, it's, if, if, if speed isn't as much of a consideration, then I would lean towards this Tamron 70-200 f2.8. Actually, what I would throw in as an option is the Nikon 70-200 f4. I like that better than Tamron. It's smaller and it's lighter. And usually in most situations where f2.8 is okay, I'm okay with f4, especially with the newer bodies. I mean, the D7200 does very good high ISO. Um, so if, if low light's not so much a concern, that's what I would look at, the Nikon 70 to 200 f4. Smaller, lighter, uh, sharper, and a fantastic lens. Plus your stand with OEM Nikon glass, which I kind of like. Um, that's what I would do. Not that I don't like the 85 f1.8, but for me, I use the 50 f1.8 on a DX body like your 7200. Uh, I love that. I have a 50 f1.4 that I use a lot too. Uh, and that's what I use for a portrait lens. So the 85 would be something I'd use more on full frame. But let me throw it back to our viewers. What would you guys do? Do you agree with me um, on how we should decide? Um, do you have a preference for the zoom or the prime? And what do you think of the 70 to 200 f4 from Nikon? That's the way I would go, but curious to see what you guys would say. Or is there something else you'd recommend? Let us know in the comments below. Let's help out Dilshan. Always great to hear back from you guys. Uh, rounds out the advice. Get some extra opinions in, some extra maybe user reviews so that our, our uh, viewers, when they're writing in with a question, can it helps them make their mind up when they got to go spend their money. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for your question, Dilshan. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.